bit of an emotional roller coaster these races. Um, you have so many highs and lows, and the highs are like really, really good, and the lows are just bloody low and just miserable. Right now, I'm not having a great leg. Not how I wanted my first Solitaire de Figaro race to go. A lot of guys have got away. Guys are 40 miles behind me, now just a mile behind me. It's just everyone seems to have closed up on me, and everyone in front's extended. And the worst case scenario, as bad as it can get. And now it looks like everyone that the pack I'm kind of with and all the guys beneath me are just getting away in more breeze and I'm up here in the corner just in a huge amount of fog and no breeze and just having to go higher and higher and probably say to myself into this less pressure all the time but I can't drive I'll be, I'll be going 170 degrees the wrong way on the course so. oh my 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 anyway 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 I'm starting to feel pretty tired now. Um, just coming into the third night at sea, uh, and I keep imagining an illusion that there's someone down below, and I keep hearing noises. And my, I've got my jacket just swinging out, and I keep imagining it, it's someone and um, like telling me to do stuff on deck. It's, it's, um, I don't think I'm quite thinking as clearly as I would normally. Uh, so I just have to watch for that. Uh, maybe try and get a bit more sleep, but wind is all over the place at the moment it's given absolutely no respite so anyway we'll carry on and press on into Gijon obviously you know I'm feeling very uh, upset with the race and how it's gone and uh, everything but when it all comes down to it I just only realise that while I'm annoyed there's not that many uh, better places than this to be annoyed and frustrated and angry. I can literally be in the Caribbean right now. The sun is out. The water's a beautiful colour. Two cell reaching. Get too much better than this thing. I'm actually enjoying this part of the lake. Only 40 miles to go. I'm sure there'll be a little uh, quirky stuff to do when we get close to shore in the high Spanish mountains but right now it's not so bad.